Moss can go ahead and drag that. Wait, what? Oh. Well. Let's not be a pain, eh? What's up, Buttercups? This is a friendly reminder that this is my first and mostly blind playthrough of Pikmin 4. Please refrain from posting spoilers on upcoming areas, features, characters, or plot points that I haven't experienced yet. However, if you have any tips, tricks, or advice to share, feel free to leave them in the comments. I'm more than happy to learn. With all that said, sit back, grab a snack, and let's get back to Pikmin 4. Thank you! What's up, Buttercups? My name is Scaletree, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Pikmin 4. Woohoo! In the last episode, we did two days of Olimar's Shipwreck Tale. We received Moss and the Yellow Pikmin, and today I'm hoping to get the Blue Pikmin. Now, as I head into the Blossoming Arcadia, the question of the day is which of the ship... Which of the Pikmin... Oh my god. <laughs> I can't, still can't talk. This is the same day of recording, by the way, as the last two episodes. Which of the Pikmin 1 ship part log entries is your favorite? I think of all of them, the Geiger counter one cracks me up the most. <laughs> oh my gosh. Olimar, you need to chill. <laughs> Although, perhaps, arguably, he's chilling a bit too much. And just to preemptively answer what some of you guys might ask in the comments, although uh, I guess it's not very preemptive if I'm getting to this on the th third episode now. Oh. <laughs> Moss, Jesus Christ. <laughs> well, we're coming off to a very smooth start to our day. <laughs> anyway. Where was I? Right. The reason I'm so obsessed with getting these onions as soon as possible is because that will open up the entire world, essentially, the entire maps for exploration. It's kind of my strategy in Pikmin 1 as well, like get the yellow Pikmin and the blue Pikmin as fast as physically possible. Because that way, I can go to any map and basically be able to accomplish any task. So, that's kind of my thought process there. While those guys are working on that, I think... I'm gonna... Uh, the problem... Oh, okay, well... Yeah, get rid of that before it causes trouble. Looks like everything is progressing very smoothly, which I appreciate. All right, electric gate demolished. Uh, and this is a shortcut back towards the original base, which I am in fact going to move here because that's going to make the transport of the blue onion a little bit faster. And uh, Moss, let's, hmm, what do we do with you? Let's have you head over here. Here? Hmm. I'm trying to think, because the next spot on my to-do list is to do this area up here. And then maybe work our way around to this area. I know that there's a ship part here that I saw in my first <laughs> aborted attempt at this area. So uh, yeah, I think I'm going to have Moss go here while Olimar and company Head on over to grab the blue onion. Man, these days feel like they just fly by. I'm so ecstatic about this. Oh, no, 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 no. We're going to make this as fast as possible. Go, go, go. <laughs> yeah, sure, you can drag that along. Why not? Actually, uh, and you know what? We need more yellows anyway. Sure. Put that in, but then... <laughs> We've got our gorgeous blue, red, and yellow onion on standby. Perfect. This is exactly what I wanted. Okay. So, 
Little guys. I'm gonna put away everyone for now, except for you, little blue. Ooh. Blue Pikmin. Interesting. I should try to increase their numbers. And I will. Gonna take care of that real quick, in fact. Just to get enough to get, like, this Waddle Quaff and stuff. I don't need to go too crazy with their numbers today because I am going to be splitting it with, uh, what's it called? I am going to be splitting their numbers with the reds and yellows, obviously. I have no reason not to. It's not like I have any other Pikmin types to balance. <laughs> so, we're gonna grab a couple of you. Oh, sorry. <laughs> and actually, I might get that tenor. I might get that tenor instead. I know it's a little bit out of the way, but it's just too... Oh wait, no, I have nine Pikmin. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. We're gonna deal with that later. You guys can start dragging that back. And actually, Moss... Um, you can go ahead and move the base here. Uh, wait, why are you guys going that way? Uh... Okay, never mind. This... This is going extremely well. <laughs> Although this did bring Moss back to me, which is fantastic. And she can take care of the tenor. Awesome. Love that for her. Love that for us. Okay. Now that we're gathering up all of these little buddies... But Moss? Are you s serious? Girl. Well, okay, you know what? This is fine. <laughs> I can have... Yeah, a fairly even split of Pikmin now, which is all I really wanted. And now that I do, we can get started on gathering up some more parts. Moss, if you could be a darling and go for this... Like, actually finish it, please. Or not. I guess it's too much for her. Her poor old bones. Um, you know what? Moss, you can bring that back. Just for now. I hope I don't sound too flustered. I'm, <laughs> uh... This is a lot. We've got a lot that we're doing right now. But... I have a I have a good feeling overall about how today is gonna go. We need to swap Pikmin and disband. So that our beloved blue beans can grab this. Whoa, oh no. Well, okay. I guess <laughs> You know, I love it when things just decide to work out, don't you? They can carry that, and I've got the perfect number, surprisingly enough, to get those two. Wait, hey! Are you serious? Ugh. Hey, 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 hey. Are well, there goes all my hopes and dreams. Ugh, <laughs> oh, love that for me. I freaking love it. You stupid skitterly. Good god. Yeah, go ahead. Carry back its corpse. I don't care anymore. The perfect numbers do not exist. And that's just something we're gonna have to deal with. Good girl, Moss. You made it back to me. <laughs> Moss, can you go ahead and fetch that, please? Thank you. I know they're already carrying it in that direction, but I think I just wanna... Just wanna destroy this thing really quick. Get the new base. Oh, no, 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 no. Actually, I need to go back to the old base because there's Pikmin sprouts there. Hmm. But you know what I can do at least? Is I can... Yeah, unlock that as a new base. Have Moss smash these, so we've got a shortcut here. 
waddle pathetically through the sticky stuff. Uh, giggity, I suppose. We're gonna start carrying these back. We're gonna give them to the blues in due time. Those guys are off to grab... Uh, gather more materials, but I guess grab also works. <sighs> this is not going fast enough. We really need to haul ass and get more friends. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. I'm so uncomfortable with how fast this is going. I'm genuinely... Ugh. I'm... You guys... I, I think I've made it kind of clear in previous episodes. I'm way more of a slow and steady wins the race kind of a player. <laughs> Pikmin 1 has never really, like, like, it's a good game, but it's not really my style. So while this is very exciting, like, please do not get me wrong, even a tiny bit. Um, I'm kind of freaking out. Where's my one idle Pikmin? Are you serious? Moss? Gather Pikmin, please. If she doesn't get that Pikmin, then oh well. <laughs> oh well. I'm doing my best here, and that's what really matters. What I think I'm gonna try is to get this last little part. So, it's time to go into my pack. And... Enjoy the spoils of bomb rocks. It feels weird to be throwing them instead of having a yellow Pikmin do them. Or is that just me? Could just be me. At least we've got red Pikmin for these slooches. And they don't have a lot of health. Very reassuring, to be honest. Okay. And now that that's done... This part's not too worse for wear. Very good. Oh, well... Yeah, I don't think we're gonna get the rest of this stuff taken care of exactly, but... I think we can totally get this part! Okay, come on, go, 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 go! We've got everybody in here. Come on, come on, come on! Yeah! <laughs> right on the dime! Oh my god, now that was a photo finish if I do say so myself! <laughs> wow. Yeah, so like I was saying, Pikmin 1 isn't really my style, but that doesn't mean I don't enjoy it. I feel very accomplished when I do a good job, I just, you know... Need to do a good job first, right? Whew! Today I got the Extraordinary Bolt and the Omega Stabilizer. Blue Pikmin, of course, that's the huge win for today. And today we got the Homesick Signal. Perfect. That's, I think, going to be exceptionally useful towards the end of these days. Emergency Kit and Super Buff. <laughs> Perfect. All right. I just need to focus on the small wins I achieve every day. Add them all up and they should equal a successful escape. You got that right, Olimar. Eleven days left. Hopefully I'm gonna be fast enough for all this stuff. I think... I may try to go back to the Sun Speckled Terrace one more time. I like the idea of sort of rotating these areas until everything is accomplished. Hmm. I don't have any more Flarlick and stuff to worry about at the Terrace. Actually, there is... There's definitely another Flarlick and Blossoming. 
And there's the BD. Hmm. I th think I'm gonna go for... Uh, should I go for one more day in Blossoming? I kind of want to. I think there's another part that's very easy to obtain early in the day if I just move my ship a little bit. So I'm gonna do Blossoming Arcadia one more time for good measure. And we're gonna see if we can achieve that expanded range to presumably unlock Serene Shores. All right, babies. Let's, um, let's go auto. Yeah. Perfect. This is exactly what we need to start our day. Oh, you know what? I need to get fire over here. So I think we're gonna go here first. We're gonna grab a little fireball. We're gonna light up the thing. We're gonna get the base. And then we're gonna burn those little uh, stick bundles. This shortcut is a necessity for this to work. And go. Perfect. We're gonna grab this base. Just mid-run. <laughs> and toss. Perfect. Uh, anything else that requires me to use these for now? Um, I guess we go back here. Uh, hey, where are you? Dude! Don't slack! <laughs> Pikmin, I swear. They just love to not listen to me. <laughs> it's their least favorite thing to do, is pay attention. Uh, sorry, fellas. I love you a lot, but come on, dude. And now, we can get this part. Man, I really need to get nectar at some point. I have way too many leaves. Uh, I probably could get the other base, but I think this is a generally fine centralized area. Is that... Are those eyes? <gasps> those are eyes. Okay. There's a part here, too. There are... There do be. There do be a part. Let's get rid of this thing. Ah, okay. Man, I hate fighting the new creeping chrysanthemums. Sorry, Pikmin. But at least with moss around, it helps. Oh, and nectar. Perfect. Perfect. Come on, come on. <laughs> oh. Ha <laughs> ha! Okay. After all these repairs, the engine output should allow us to go even further. I'm starting to see the faintest glimmer of hope. It's what we deserve, Olimar. It's what we deserve. Hey, you. They should go to the blues. And actually, here. Moss? Can you really quickly grab this base? Because I think that's going to be faster than going to the other one. And this one should also go to Blue Pikmin. Moss arrived at destination. Perfect. Move base, please. Excellent. Let's see. What are we doing here? What are we doing here? Ah. Well, I think that's as good a spot as any to keep moving. Oh, and more. Oh. Does this thing have a part? I mean, it's not showing us a star. Oh. Sorry, the boss theme? The Pikmin 2 boss theme? Yes. That's everything I could have possibly wanted. Okay. First, let's make sure that we have everybody. Grab this one blue Pikmin. 
And Moss, please, uh, come on over here. Looks like we've got a boss to fight. We probably shouldn't open those since those are probably the little downy offspring. Let's go up here and... Ah, Moss. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. I don't know if we can waste time fighting a boss, but I kind of want to give it a go. Uh, screw it, you know? Actually, wait. No, 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 no. I think the least useful Pikmin for this flight, but the fight will be Blues. So I'm gonna let those guys take care of the Flarlick to get us some more numbers. And now, let's do this. Boss time. Oh, <laughs> at least they go down way easier than they did ever before. Oh, Olimar. Oh, God. Well, um, that was unpleasant. <sighs> red Pikmin, Red Pikmin, come on. We need the Reds because they do the most damage. And, duly noted, uh, that apparently the bosses do contain ship parts and they just don't show up. Well, <laughs> that was certainly something, wasn't it? Moss can go ahead and drag that. Wait, what? Oh. Well, let's not be a pain, eh? Well, while that happens, is there anything else I can do over here? Uh, honestly, not really. Not until everything gets back to the ship. So let's gather up our comrades. I guess five are at the ship right now. So, I'm gonna take everybody over here. Move the base so that we can try to get that other part over there. Now, while we're moving everything right along here, I think I didn't ask a question of the day yet, did I? No, I did. I did. <laughs> I asked about the voyage log. Please excuse me. It's been 24 minutes, you know. That's practically years ago. Okay. Olimar arrived at destination. I think that's all the... Far from done, but I won't give up. Damn right, Olimar. As it should be. Let's... Grab up some more buddies. And... Go auto. Okay. And now we can switch over to Olimar. And get this base situated. Perfect. I love- I'm, I'm, I'm trying to take advantage of the fact that Moss teleports with it. I think that's extremely useful. Oh wait, there's another chrysanthemum that we need to get rid of. I fought it on my first bad day here. And, uh, oh yeah. That went way better. 60 Pikmin, I guess, is the sweet spot. Blues, Andale. And yellows, you can get this. Because uh, we're going to need a lot of you for that beady fight. I think I'll be able to jump up there with Moss. Raw material transported. Perfect. More yellows achieved. And now... Let's see how many... Oh, I can pull out basically all yellows. Nice. We're gonna... Oh. Hey. We're gonna go with that. And, um... Uh, two reds for the cause. I just want to have a full squad when I fight Beatty. I guess today is a boss rush day. 
I had no idea that it would be this way when I started recording, but... Oh. Oh. Or maybe it's not a boss rush day. Maybe I just have wishful thinking. I need to head this direction. <laughs> Let's see what's over here for us to face. I mean, I guess I just go around this way. Nice. It's so interesting to see Beady, but he's, like, green. I'm so used to him being gold. I don't think I can do this deathless, but I can certainly try. Come on, buddies. Okay, okay, okay. We're calm. We're good. We're cool. We're awesome, in fact. And we're deathless! Oh! Oh, charming! <laughs> of course you're gonna lob my tights at us! You assholes! <laughs> alright, everybody, alright, alright. Calm down, calm down. <laughs> oh, I love Pikmin. It's so needlessly, needlessly vicious. There's another part up here. Might as well grab it while I've got a bajillion yellows to my name. Let's go! And, yep, let's double up those numbers. Get it nice and fast if I have anything to say about this. Let's speed you up too, Moss. You and your hilarious... Wide, intrigued, doggy eyes. Oh, this is perfect. Wow, how many parts did we get today? We increased the dolphin's capabilities and then some. Huh. You know, I think this is exactly what I needed today. I was worried, you know, because I'm not really a Dandori queen or anything. I just... I, I like taking my time and exploring around. That's one of the reasons why Pikmin 2 is my favorite without a shadow of a doubt, but... Okay, this takes us to where that yellow onion was. Whoa! Oh, hey, 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 everybody, everybody. Easy. <laughs> I hope you don't mind that I'm running over here. I just want to see if there's anything else I might have missed. No? Huh. <sighs> well, I don't know about you guys, but I'm feeling very accomplished. Woohoo! Twelve ship parts in, I think, four days? This was by far my most productive day in this shipwreck tail run. And I think that's extremely cool. I'm feeling quite satisfied with myself. Quite pleased indeed. Wow. Yeah, yes. Five parts. We got the automatic gear, the repair type bolt, the extraordinary bolt, the radiation canopy, and the ionium jet. We did lose more Pikmin today, but that's fine. We still net grew our numbers. And, yes, I have the idler's alert now. Let's fucking go. <laughs> That's exactly what I needed. We've got a trackinator, an emergency kit, the rush boots. Hell yes, I've been missing those. And the parts detector. Wow, what a haul. What a haul for today. Excellent news. The repairs made to the SS Dolphin have made it possible to fly to more distant areas. As a result, my search radius has also expanded quite a bit. For now, I need to go about this search strategically. I believe you, buddy. Let's see. Ten days left. Um. Let's see. Ten days. We've got... 18 parts left to get, so I still need to average kind of two parts a day. Oh! Oh! I completed getting all of the ship parts. It is kind of a bummer that I didn't get the onion last second. 
I'm gonna call that okay, to be perfectly honest. I don't feel like going back there just to get a duplicate onion. I might later, if that ends up mattering. <laughs> like, let me know if that matters. If it, if it does, then I'll do it. But otherwise, I need... Well, need. <laughs> need might be a stretch. I want to focus my efforts on the Sun Speckled Terrace and Serene Shores. Hmm. It's only been half an hour. Do I want to do one more day? You know? I think I'm gonna exit for now. Because honestly, I miss seeing Kip Kip in the Rescue Command post, and you guys have seen... You know, you guys saw nothing but Olimar and Moss last episode. So, let's go around and say hi to everybody really quick. Because you know what I realize? I realize we didn't finish talking to some of our friends. Our new rescuees and the people that we've gotten some stuff from. I think this is the perfect time to take care of that. Whenever you want to hear my story, come see me. Oh, I will, Olimar. You bet I will. I have the full intention of hearing out the remainder of your story as piloted by a complete nincompoop, because I feel like you would be way better at, at Tantori than me. Okay. So. Let's go ahead and talk to the people we've completed quests for. Wow, this is a terrible angle! <laughs> Ochi is staring real hard at Petunia's shoulder here. Guys, uh, do me a favor, screenshot this and give it, like, a meme caption. I would love to share that in my community tab. <laughs> Atakoso. Oh, it's you again. This is fascinating. I was able to confirm that the onion has fused. Woohoo! Ten materials! Please keep collecting different colors of onions. I've got a lot of more research to do. Okay, five onions. So I do know that there is an onion for every Pikmin type in the game. I'm extremely curious to see where the others come in. Obviously, they're all post-game onions, because, you know, we completed the main game. Very excited to see where that goes. <gasps> oh, and let's not forget, we gotta talk to Dingo. Hey, Dingo, I, I hope you don't mind that Kip Kip <laughs> flirted with you last episode. Um, not episode, last stream. Um... She was, uh, she was, she was pressured to do so <laughs> by the chat, and it broke the fabric of reality. I'm really sorry, Dingo. You're, you're not, you're, you're not gonna get any girls anytime soon. Sorry, man. Love you, though. Like, you mean a lot to me, personally. Anyway. Oh, you think you've got this under control? Is that it? <sighs> no one can pull a fast one on me. Hm. Woohoo! 30 materials from four 100 percented areas. Oh, I see. Well, you're not done yet, newbie. Keep at it and finish the job. Five areas. All right. <laughs> this is so cool. Man, we're getting a lot of raw material. Maybe I should talk to Russ and Shepard. I feel like I kind of want to save that for when I know I'm about to do a day mission. Actually, hey, you know... I have heard that Dingo kind of becomes nicer to you. <laughs> like, a little nicer to the player character after you rescue Olimar, so let's just chat. Aww. You really do have some skills. It's kind of annoying. They've investigated every area to 100% so far. <clears throat> of course, you haven't completed all your missions yet. Let's see if you can keep that successful streak going. I think we got this. I think we got this, Dingo. I'm, I'm orbiting you. I'm studying you right now. <laughs> Uh, so you need my help, eh, newbie? Uh, I guess I can lend a hand while I ramp back up. Uh, but don't start thinking I'm gonna do everything for you. I'll only step in when you really need it. I wouldn't have it any other way, Dingo. You need to get your rest, you know? You gotta guard the camp. You gotta make sure everything is in tip-top shape here. You gotta be up to date with all of the naps you're probably taking. It's, it's very important stuff. It's critical. It's mission in, It's mission critical. <sighs> Anybody else I need to talk to? I don't think so. Yeah, I feel like that's basically everybody. Okay, 
Now that I feel a little bit more comfortable with the episode length, I think this is as good a place as any to end the episode. So, next time on Pikmin 4, we're going to continue Olimar's shipwreck tale. We're going to explore the revamped Serene Shores, see how many parts we can grab from there. Since we've got all three Pikmin types, I have a pretty good feeling about this. If we're half as successful as I was on that last day that I played in Blossoming Arcadia, I think we might even finish this this adventure with, like, days to spare. Obviously, I'm not counting on it, but hey, <laughs> a girl can dream, right? Anyway, thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you have an incredible day. Take care, everyone! Bye-bye! <laughs>